been working on a project in collaboration with CMS CERN where um, we try to make, create a project where art meets science. So first of all, when we first visited CERN, I was quite impressed by this image and I wanted to use it in a project of my own. I decided to place mirror mosaics and what the mosaic represents is the whole of scientific knowledge and uh, the back of the shell is dark because it's about what we haven't yet figured out. I did a brick wall that's exploding towards you with the particle detector in the middle. So the particle detector is its quite an artistic object representing in a way of how we're starting to link in global opinion the fields of science and art. And so I'm showing that this is the thing that is actually breaking the wall between the two, the two fields that have been put up by public opinion and such. It's based on the idea of uh, dark matter and dark energy, which makes up most of the universe, but we can't see it. And the mirror idea, how two mirrors reflect infinity, and how, um, in theory of knowledge, we learned about how nothing and infinity are two things that it's really hard to imagine. The box, well, it's meant to evoke your curiosity, and curiosity is the key to acquiring knowledge and discovering things. So that's the whole idea with science and so on. It's a digital painting made by me. The centerpiece is a scientist that's supposed to represent uh, all of CERN and he has a magnifying glass and a pipe too. I want to have some resemblance with Sherlock Holmes and he is uh, looking at the solar system and finds clues to answers and to how everything works. Similar to how Sherlock Holmes finds clues to his cases. My dad, who's friends with someone from CERN, told me, "Oh, did you know they call um, they have something they call soup, which is between electrons?" And I thought that why not take something to do with like pop culture, like Andy Warhol, and then marry it with like science. Um, that's why I decided to take the initial thing and then make it my own, and putting what I learned from everything I read on like the Higgs boson and the God particle and stuff um, into one element. First of all, I found the, the day at CERN really, really interesting and the physics really interests me. I got to, to see the lab and the, to meet the people who work there. It was a great opportunity also to learn new things about particle physics. So it's kind of a new thing and it's happening right in front of your eyes. So I learned a lot and I'm, I really love this project so I'm really happy uh, we got to do it.